Hi, I'm Dr. Alison Grimaldi, and today we'll be talking hips. When assessing a new patient with hip pain, it's important to listen carefully and to allow adequate time for a detailed patient interview. The initial focus is often on pain location and behaviour, a brief history and screening for red flags. However, there is so much to be gained by digging deeper into factors that influence biological and psychological loads on the individual. For example, we really need to know not just our patient's occupation, but how and how much they sit, stand, walk, squat, lift, etc. and what their work environment is like. Not just that they go to the gym, but exactly what exercises they do and at what volume, intensity, speed and range of motion. Having an awareness of psychological factors from the outset is also key. Not just anxiety and depression, but the patient's fears, beliefs, level of confidence, expectations and support systems. This information is gold and these factors can have a potent impact on your treatment direction and outcomes. You can read some tips in my blog on balancing information gathering and efficiency. And I've also shared our clinic's online pre-assessment questionnaire, which we've found invaluable. Thanks for joining me and I'll see you next time on Talking Hips with Dr. Ali.